evening. Right, I need to stop saying that at the start of every single video because it's going to start becoming a thing and I don't really want that to happen. But um, for now, my intro is good evening, so just get over it. Mm. I also forgot to say, by the way, yes, I know every single YouTuber is on this video, but like, shut up, maybe? I don't know. Okay, so basically my sleep schedule is a bit erratic, to be honest. I either come home from school and I go straight to sleep and then I don't wake up until the next morning, or else I'll go to sleep at like... 3 a.m., 4 a.m., and then wake up like three hours later for school. It's either one or the other. There's no in between. We've never heard of like an eight hour sleep, like sleeping schedule. We don't know her. I could just feel a night coming on where I wasn't gonna sleep. So I was like, let's video it. Let's do some fun things. Because usually my all nighters, I usually just lie in bed and watch videos. So I was like, if I'm gonna be awake, I may as well do something. I have so many activities planned. Like, I'm actually really, really excited, to be honest. I'm really, really excited. I love English. So it's quarter to one now, which is still quite early. We still have a lot of time to do things. So we're gonna go to the 24 hour Starbucks and then we're also gonna go to the 24 hour Tesco's and just pick up some fun things. Maybe, maybe I'll bake or something. I've got croissants in the fridge I can bake. When I say bake, I use the term loosely. Like all you do is put them in the oven. Did you know just roll croissants are vegan? I bet you didn't know that because they are absolutely gorgeous. I was thinking I could like risk my life a bit and bring my dog for a walk. Cause like I am a girl and like walking at night is just not really a thing is it? Like I will be kidnapped and raped but like I may as well just like for the views. Also oh my god I realise you've never been introduced to my lovely cat Tigger. I love you Tigger. So basically me and Tigger used to be like BFS like she was my bitch. But then she got a bit of like a, a UTI kind of problem. I know it happens Tigger it happens. And basically she just started to piss everywhere. So she likes to stay in my room. And she sleeps on my bed. And it got to the point where we'd look each other in the eye. I'd be, I'd be on my phone and I'd just look over. And she'd look at me and she'd be like, I'm pissing on your bed. And this was quite a common occurrence. So I was like, right, mum, we're taking her to the vet. Like, I can't have this anymore. She's pissing all over me. And um, it's not a vibe. But we lost our cat box. So on the way, she was sitting on my knee. And she pissed blood all over me. Like, all over me. So, like, after that... It's just not really been the same. Like, you can't really bounce back from that, can you? I don't know, there's a bit of a weird vibe going on between us. I've lost all my time. Like, I am literally pale again. How depressing is that? But I've decided that sunbed season is done um, until next summer. It's just, it just has to happen. Or else there's a potential risk of raging skin cancer. Also, I don't know if you can tell in this light, but I was looking at myself earlier and I was like, Olivia, you have a fucking five o'clock shadow. It was just so grey, like around this area, and like I just cannot be bothered anymore. I can't be bothered. And I was gonna like try put foundation on for this video, and then I was like, you know what, not. Do you know what? I'm not. I'm not triggered about this, but right, my formal or prom or whatever you wanna call it is in a month, and we have awards at it, but it's like a piss take, so like it's kind of like funny awards. Funny, you call it funny or you call it bullying. I'm fine, I'm actually fine. So one of the awards is Catfish, and I am one of the nominees. Like, Stop! I know, okay, on my Instagram I look completely different, but like on my YouTube I like to keep it real. <laughs> I thought that if I called myself a catfish then no one else would, but it didn't work. I came to a depressing realization today. I have more followers on TikTok than Instagram. Uh, I know, I know. It's not good, it's just not good, but like, I just, I think I thrive on TikTok. Like my TikTok is popping off at the minute. See, see at the start of every single video, I swear I talk for about 10 minutes and I have to edit it down to like 30 seconds because absolutely no one wants that when they click on a video. <gasps> Sometimes I forget to breathe then I just like get it out in one breath. Do you ever get like when you have a sentence and you just wanna get out in one breath? Like you don't wanna just ruin it by taking a breath in the middle. I just did it again, oh my God. So if you understood any of that, well done. I'm going to sign off now and, and update you when I'm going to Starbucks. Wow, I'm so excited. Oh my god, I'm gonna get a pumpkin spice latte. I hadn't even thought of that yet. Okay, so basically pumpkin spice lattes came out last week and I've never tried one. I know you think, Olivia, you're the whitest Tabisco girl there is, but like, I don't know, I just never tried one before, so today is the day. I just thought I'd take a quick selfie with the spider that I killed three weeks ago and it's still on my wall. I just like to keep the corpses of my victims. I'll show you a quick, quick close up. Oh my god, she's thriving. What are we gonna call her? Mrs. Shy. Me and Miss Shy. I'm um, sorry, absolutely not. I just walked from my front door to my car and I could just like tell there's like five murderers in my driveway at least. It was not a vibe. I don't like being outside at night, so we will not be bringing my dog on a walk. I lied about that earlier on. So psych. <laughs> it's also like 10 degrees, which I'm not. I'm not loving, so like I'm not gonna go outside in that. I just hate the cold. I wish it was summer again. I miss hot girl summer. <laughs> I just want to live in Bali. I'm gonna move to Bali, I think. Right, one view in this video and I'll drop out of school and move to Bali. Right, so it is one o'clock and we're going to Starbies. Woo! Hi, and um, if I get 
almond milk in a pumpkin spice latte? Is it dairy free? Um, wow. Um, I'll have to check. The, I'm not sure about the like pumpkin this. syrup. It should be. But just give me one minute and I'll just check the allergies, okay? Okay, no problem. Thank you. And what was going on? Hey, is Wendy working today? Question, is Wendy working today? Bro, you didn't roll your window down. What? Okay, like that was probably the weirdest experience I've ever had at that drive through It just took like really long and then she was playing like rock music and I was like, this is really weird vibes and I'm probably never going to come back here at this time. But alas, I got my two drinks. I thought, you know what, I've had two coffees today already. What's another two? Do you know what I mean? And I'm going to be staying up for another, what, five hours. So we're going to be needing some caffeine. I'm also, like, terrified because there's, like, five cars in this car park. And they're all just, like, sitting with their lights on. Like, what are you doing? Like, are you doing a Starbucks drink review? Right, here's the moment of truth. I've hyped this up for so fucking long. Like, you white girls have really done bits for this pumpkin spice latte. So it better be nice. Okay, I'm scared. Why does it taste like curry? It literally tastes like curry. I mean, I would drink it. It just tastes like cinnamon and curry powder put in milk. And I can't taste the coffee at all. Like, literally in my last video, I was like, Starbucks almond milk is fucking disgusting. Never get it. And I'm like, I just, I, I decided I don't like it cold, but I like it in hot drinks. I've also moved on to hot drinks now because it's fucking freezing in Belfast. Next is my, this is my classic grande almond milk latte with an extra shot. Let's give her a go. That's much nicer, I think. I'm also on like a strictly coffee diet because my formals next month or prom, I don't really know. Like, is it only Northern Ireland that calls it formal or is that also like an English thing? Who knows? So I had my first dress fitting today and I just felt like I could be doing such more bits if I was a skinny legend. So I said to my mum, mum, I feel like I have a belly in this dress. And she was like, just do sit-ups, which is not what you're supposed to say. You're meant to be like, Olivia, no, you don't. You're perfect. So now I feel really self-conscious and I'm just going to drink loads of coffee until like poo on my insides or something. I don't know. Welcome to t -t 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 Tesco's! Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to t -t 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 Target! Right, so that was easily the weirdest experience of my life. Probably weirder than Starbucks. It was like a ghost town and it was just like all these people in like plain clothes unpacking things and there's just like rubbish everywhere. And I just like, I just I just got murder vibes. I was like, this is where it ends. But then I saw a policeman. He was the only other person in the shop that wasn't working. And I was like, okay, yeah, sweet. Like I'm safe now, there's a policeman here. And then he bought a fucking bottle of milk and started drinking it straight from the bottle. And I was like, clearly you are a weirdo. Full fat milk and a banana. I was like, this that looks like a challenge or something. And guess what? No chocolate hoops. Oh, CBA. I don't know what it is. Like, they haven't had it for months. See if they're discontinued. I am suing Tesco's. Okay, so quick Tesco haul. I got so much. This might take a while, but first of all, we got Prit Stick. This is for later. I'm not telling you why just yet. It's a surprise. And I got some smoky olives. And that's it. That is literally it. Right, so I'm going to go home now. I'm probably just like listening to some TikTok songs on the way home. Oh my god. I was listening to TikTok songs on the way here, and you know, Wait a Minute by Willow Smith, that's a classic uh, TikTok song. And I discovered I can do an amazing impression of her. Hold on. Wait a minute. No, I can't, it was really bad. I think I left my conscience in a fantastic. What do you think? That was just really hard to listen to. I'm really sorry about that. The policeman's are probably literally like standing like with his gun pointed at me at this point. Okay, so it is 2.30. And I'm just a bit bored, so I thought, it's time for a fashion show. So Pretty Little Thing like sent me over some clothes, not sponsored, but like, please sponsor me. I thought it was my duty to just show you how they look on. It is now three 
I am feeling a bit delusional. I don't know if it's like the 10 espresso shots I've had or if I'm actually tired because I only had about three hours sleep last night, but we're just gonna push through. So I thought, let's do something fun because if I don't do something fun, I'm probably gonna fall asleep. So naturally, the first thing that came to my head was let's just like make our eyebrows disappear. Like you know the thing drag queens do where they glue down their eyebrows? I've just always like felt the need to do that. So here we are. What better time than at 3 a.m. in the morning to just make your eyebrows disappear? I'm not sure what I expected, but I don't think it was this. <laughs> I'm so confused right now. I did such a bad job though. Look how shit that looks like I literally just put foundation over my eyebrows. But anyway, I also saw this thing going around on TikTok, right? Where you put eyelash glue on your on your cupid's bow and then you like stick your lip like this on top and it makes you have like really big lips. My skin's not gonna be okay after this. You do wonder what goes on in my head, don't you? Ready? Three, two, one. Oh my god. What the genuine fuck? It's crackhead or it really is crackhead or. What the fuck is that? <laughs> what the fuck? Right, I decided it's getting to the point I'm kind of scared of looking at myself, so we're gonna try to take this off now. This was probably one of the more stupid things I've done. I literally put like half a print stick in my eyebrow. <laughs> I put a whole bag of jelly beans up my ass. To make a long fucking story short, I put a whole bag of jelly beans up my ass. Right, well now that's off my face, we're just gonna do a quick skincare. I use La Roche Posse Effeclar Dew. Then I use Embryolis. Who really knows? Lay cream for moisturizer. And then, because we're not greasy enough, we're gonna be using the, oh my god, like, if you don't use this, like, you need to get on this shit. It's a super drug vitamin A hydrating mist. It's so good. Why do I look so greasy? Just you wait until this goes on. This is light of mine. I'm gonna let it shine. This is already mine. I'm gonna let it shine. Sorry. Sorry about that. Guys, I'm just, like, not myself right now. I'm just really, really tired. Am I tired? I don't know. I feel like my body wants to be tired, but because I have like 10 espresso shots like coursing through my veins, it's really confused and now I just feel funny. I feel like the only solution is to go eat a pizza? No. Tell me no. Tell me I should not go cook a pizza. Well, I'm a weak bitch, but like, it was always gonna happen at some point, wasn't it? Anyway, well that's cooking. Should we just have like a dance party or something? I'm gonna listen to my TikTok song, but I'll be putting some non-copyright music over the top of it, so you can enjoy that, but I'm gonna be having fun. What are you doing in my swamp? What, 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 what are you doing in my swamp? Beautiful. Also, if you don't eat your pizza with ketchup, you are weak and will be probably killed out by natural selection pretty soon. I feel kind of awkward just eating it like right beside the corpse of the spider that I just killed. I hope I'm like still let into heaven. Direct me to church. I'll worship like a dark at the shrine of your lies. You know, 
I might just have to end the video now. What time is it? Right, it's nearly five. I, I'm not tired. Like, I always say up until past five. But, like, I'm not doing anything else apart from watching YouTube, which you don't want to see. Please follow my Instagram and subscribe to me, please. Because I just want, I want to be famous. I'm not going to sleep yet. It is an all-nighter. I'm going to stay up until the morning, okay? Believe me. Okay, bye. <laughs>